Nicole here and I've had a really great question which I wanted to share with you all so that I can help you with that as well. Um, one of my students wanted to know what is a homophone? Whew, quite technical. You don't really need to know the word homophone. All you need to know is that a homophone is um, where you have two or more words that have the identical pronunciation. They sound exactly the same, but their spelling and their meaning is completely different. So you might have the word by, B-U-Y, and by, B-Y-E. You know, you buy something at a shop and you say goodbye. They sound exactly the same, by, by, but the spelling and the meaning is different. That's what a homophone is. Should I give you some examples? Okay, so we've got the word aisle, aisle, and aisle. <laughs> the first one, aisle, A-I-S-L-E, is really for a corridor, a hallway, a passageway, I suppose, um, in a plane, in a church, uh, maybe even in a boat, for example. So a passageway. The second aisle, I-S-L-E, is a small island. And the third aisle, I apostrophe double L, is the contracted form of I will. Easy. <laughs> then we've got scent, scent, and scent. The first scent, C-E-N-T, is a coin, you know, not a dollar, but a cent. <laughs> the second scent, S-C-E-N-T, is a smell, an odor. And the last scent, S-E-N-T, is the past form of send, sending a letter, for example. <laughs> um, then, of course, we've got easy ones like for, F-O-R, the preposition, and for, F-O-U-R, the number. Or we've got um, rain, R-A-I-N. Yep, the rain coming down from the sky. Or we've got rain, R-E-I-N, which is like the, well, let's call it the ropes, I suppose, that you attach to a horse so that you can ride them. You hold the, the ropes, the rain. Um, and then you've also got rain, R-E-I-G-N, which is the rule of a queen or a king and how long they are a ruler for. Um, yeah, so anyway, there's just a few. They're called homophones. So again, a homophone is where two or more words sound the same, the pronunciation is the same, but their spelling and their meaning is different. I hope that helped. <laughs> Have a great day. Bye.